friends, Jerry Rosa here in the Rosa String Works Workshop. It is 4th of July, Independence Day. Happy 4th of July to all those out there, all the uh, fathers standing outside grilling the hot dogs. <laughs> yeah, it's today's kind of a traditional barbecue day in the United States. Uh, seems like everybody barbecues and has an outdoor thing, picnic type thing on the 4th of July. Me, not so much. I'm working in the shop. <laughs> I just edited a video that I'm going to send out here yet uh, today. And it, in fact, I'm not sure if this vlog will hit the air first or if the other video that I edited. The other video is about straightening up a crooked tailpiece on a mandolin. So I think you're going to enjoy that. I am going to start working on this, finishing up this Gibson. See the finish on it now? It looks pretty darn good. It's not perfect. Now the top looks kind of matted and that's from the overspray of doing this. And you might say, well, why didn't you tape it off? Well, taping it off is not that simple on a finish like these things. I think I can just rub this out and buff it out and I think I'll be good to go. And if not, I'll deal with it another way. But right now, I think I'm okay. And again, because it's the fourth, I probably won't work real hard on it, but I'll work on it a little bit anyway. I did get a viewer gift. This came from Paul Taylor up in St. Louis. And you might ask, well, what is that? Well, it is a bridge pin puller. And so to pull that pin, I just take this and insert it like this. First time I've tried using it, so let's see if it works. Now you can see there, that pin is in that block pretty tightly. And boom, pulled it right out. It gives you a lot of leverage, that's for sure. So thank you, Paul Taylor, for that. I'll keep this here on the bench and I may start using that. You know, I kind of think it's going to work in most cases, but like if there's a tall saddle in front of this, I could see that this might have a problem. If the pin's in really low, this might have a problem. And in those cases, I'll for sure go back to this. This works on almost anything, I have to tell you, where, you know, I don't know about this yet since I've never used it, but it works really good right now, I can tell you. It fits that pin really well, and it just grabs a hold of it and you got a lot of leverage with that so I'm looking forward to trying it out thanks Paul something else I wanted to uh, update you all on since you guys have seen my band many times it turns out that Gary the guitar player the big fella has COVID and so does Bill who plays the other guitar he plays more lead guitar Bill Pilliard so I think they both have COVID and so this coming Tuesday tomorrow at the restaurant it might just be me, I don't know. They were all together at a, at, at a festival and I went over there and jammed with them on Wednesday evening. Well, wouldn't you know, Thursday, they announced they had COVID. Now, I don't feel like I've come down with anything at this point, but it hasn't been a full week yet. So who knows, I may come down with it too. You just never can tell. I've already had it once. They say the second time can actually be worse, so we'll see. Well, that's going to be about it for today's short vlog. Watch for that other video on uh, straightening up that mandolin tailpiece. Thanks for watching. We'll see you tomorrow.